Talk about a find. Uh, this is the latest exhibit at the San Antonio Art Museum, a Roman bust that's 2,000 years old. The owner is an Austin woman who bought it for about 35 bucks. Here's Matt Houston, he explains. Cameras are a little new for old Sextus Pompey. It's a pretty cool story. Though he's been a focal point in stately rooms before. This is a... This is like kind of an outlaw figure. Lindley McAlpine says she's the San Antonio Museum of Art's nerdy detective. This case is still open, since there's some debate whether this is the man who lived to kill Julius Caesar and his successors. In the Louvre, they call, they call him the young Pompey question mark. But Laura Young named him Dennis after a TV character. And I've been down, I look at it, it's on the floor. It clearly looks old. The antique dealer hoped to flip the 52-pound head she found at an Austin Goodwill until an auctioneer told her it was probably stolen. So Dennis spent four years staring from a side table while Young met with historians. So, yeah, he became a presence. Turns out he's a survivor. Dennis escaped Rome's demise to a German king's collection, which escaped Allied bombs and storage during World War II. Historians think an American soldier looted the portrait, which eventually escaped the Austin thrift store. There's no reason to not buy it for 35, right? In Young's car. It soon became clear Dennis would fit best with other busts like him here. This is a happy ending. It's, it's taken 75 years to get here. Dennis will stay in San Antonio for a year before he returns to the German collection from which he came, with new stories for a growing and eager audience.